Hey guys, so yeah, some of you know I'm doing this 12 days of Christmas challenge thing this year um, to raise awareness of UK poverty. Um, and some of you just may be wondering, well, what, what exactly is it like for a family living in poverty in the UK this Christmas? Um, so I want to share with you this really powerful video which um, the amazing team at Christians Against Poverty have put together um, of a family who, yeah, are really struggling in debt and have been struggling in debt um, in the UK and just kind of the effects this has had on their lives, but also the incredible work of CAP and how that's really just helped to, to begin to change their life around um, and just bring hope um, this Christmas. So yeah, enjoy this video and I hope it inspires you to keep following me um, as I'm doing these challenges, maybe join in with some of them um, and also if you're able to, to, to give a little bit of money um, towards combating and, and challenging UK poverty through the work of CAP. Here's the video guys. Worst thing war is just hiding away from people, scared to, to okay. answer the door. Yeah. Looking on his shoulder all the time. Sometimes my mom, dad told us, Chloe, Tyler, Alex and Dan and go upstairs and hide. So we hid under our blanket. It was very, very scary. Because it's like, oh, I hope they're not here to get us or all like that. There was one day um, a doorstop lender come knocking at the door. We had £20 in our pocket. We gave basically most of it away. We was left with five pound in our pocket to actually get the day-to-day -day things we needed. And we didn't have nothing in the cupboard. Uh, we had no nappies. We felt like as the world were ending. Cause there was no way of getting out until Cap come along. And then once Lana come along, big relief. We didn't have no food at all until Cap came in and said, come on, you can be on Cap's side. Lorna came out for a visit um, and she talked to us for a bit and we didn't know she was going to bring the Christmas hamper at all. And uh, uh, before she left, uh, she asked Colin to go out to a car and they come in with this really big box. And we were like, Dad, Dad, is that for us? And he said, yeah, so we all put it on for when it was Christmas and we were like, I want to wait and see what we can eat. We looked in it and there was all sorts. It really helped us a lot. There was just a little game for the kids, snakes and ladders. And after Lorna went, they just played on it forever. <laughs> I'm sure that was the best toy they had. <laughs> it's not just about presents, is it? It's about the gift of God and Jesus. He, that's... Only one big gift that we got was Jesus. We got baptised. I felt different when I got, got ducked in that water and then come out. It feels like God's spirit come into me. And it's, it's, it's hard to explain. What a good feeling. <laughs> I haven't been baptised yet, but I said, I give my life to Jesus. 